Hey YouTube, this is Garrowin with another video. I just wanted to make this video to show one of the reasons I switched to PC gaming. Uh, I had an issue similar to this in a previous Fallout game, Fallout New Vegas, where a quest got bugged and the only way, uh, basically it was impossible for me to finish the quest because I was at the time playing on the PlayStation 3, I was on the console. Uh, I just was uh, cleaning out the Super Duper Mart here for a quest and I came across, uh, upstairs there was just an unnamed character named Minuteman laying on, on a table. And then I get down here and I find this guy named Josh. And so I got, one, I got to wondering, I was like, is Josh somebody important? Is it somebody who I could have saved? Uh, well, thanks a lot, dog meat. Hey. Uh, and so uh, I opened up my browser on Steam Get here to find out exactly who Josh is. And then I started... Shoo, get out of the way, dog meat. Hey. Shoo. Go there. And, uh, and I started finding all these messages about... Josh's hollow tape, and apparently, this guy is supposed to have a hollow tape on him that kind of uh, hints that maybe he was one of the people that was with, um, maybe he was one of the eight survivors. Remember when you first meet uh, uh, the characters at the beginning of the game? He says there used to be eight, now there's five, and uh, you can see here in my inventory under miscellaneous. Josh's hollow tape is not here. And in the web browser and I've I've found all kinds of people talking about, you know, Emma's not in the supermarket, missing hollow tapes. And so I've I've done a little bit of reading because I didn't want to do something I didn't want to, you know, I didn't want to do something I wasn't supposed to do. I didn't want to cheat. Uh, you know, if I wasn't supposed to find the hollow tape here, if it was supposed to be somewhere else, that was fine. But uh it, as it turns out, it's a, an issue that's affecting console players and PC players alike. And so I said, you know, I want to hear what's on this holotape. This is obviously not something that's my fault. And so since we're on PC, we have the freedom to fix this bug ourselves with the command console. Now this is actually going to be the first time I've done this ever on this game. Uh, it's actually been pretty rock solid experience so far. So, uh, what we're going to do because we're on the PC, we're going to use uh, one of the console commands here, and we can see that in order to give ourselves items, uh, we basically have to reference ourselves, say add item, and then each item in the game has a unique ID. So, I've looked up Josh's holotape and got the ID for that. And so we're going to say what are we are six zeros one four dot add item. So we're going to go one two three four five six one four dot add item space. And then Josh's hollow tape is double dot sixteen two seventy seven a. There we go. And now we can see that Josh's hollow tape is in our inventory here. Let's listen to it. So that's Josh's holotape. So if you're on PC and you get here and for whatever reason the holotape is not here like apparently all of these people are experiencing, uh, you can see as it stands there are supposed to be two holotapes present in the Lexington Super Duper Mart, one on the body of a Minuteman named Josh and another on the body of a girl named Emma. Uh, so we'll go see if Emma's is there. But if you get here and that's not here, if you're playing on PC, you have the freedom to uh, to fix it yourself. And uh, you know that's one of the reasons I, I switched to PC gaming. There was the bug in Fallout New Vegas, and then there was there's been a time or two in gaming where I, I wish I had I wished I had the ability to either mod the game 
uh, or to uh, to take advantage of something like a command console to fix a bug that the developers had not yet fixed and uh, and so that's one of the advantages of PC gaming and one of the reasons that I finally bit the bullet sold my PS4 and switched altogether so uh, I'm going to poke around and see if I can't track down this Emma who uh, I believe he said he, he t sent her down to the loading dock see if we can find her and see if her holotape is uh, is on her body alrighty so we have made it to the loading docks there was a short laser musket over here that dog meat brought to me and hurled it somewhere or another but if, from what I understand Emma is supposed to be in here somewhere in the loading dock so let's br before I go looking for her too much because that was another problem that people were having was that Emma was not even down here so let's bring up the steam overlay and let's say fallout for Emma's body well that's one of the top mis <laughs> Google searches but okay uh, Emma's holotape location It looks like he's right in here. Yeah, I opened the door. But, uh... So she's supposed to be laying right here, propped up against these ammo cans. Uh, right next to the terminal here. And she's not here. So, just like we did before, let's uh, pause the game so nothing really happens out of the ordinary. And we're going to say... Just out of curiosity, like I said, since, uh, okay, so the last command I entered does show up, so all I really need is, uh, Fallout for Emma's Holotape. Emma's Holotape, Fallout Wiki, and we need this item ID, so double lot 16, 277B. Uh, so we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 4, dot add item. Double lot sixteen two seventy seven B. Emma's hollow tape. Alrighty, I'll turn the volume back up for this one so you guys can hear it a little better if you if you care. So, I just wanted to show you guys, A, if you have this problem, how to fix it, and B, one of the primary reasons that I switched to PC gaming. Uh, you know, are there people that use features like this to cheat? Yeah, alright, but uh, if it's a single player game and they are, they're getting enjoyment out of doing it, then, you know, I don't see a problem with it. Uh, but for me, like I said, this is the first time that I have actually used the console in this game to do anything, and I sort of wish I had been playing Fallout New Vegas on PC years and years back when I broke that quest, because I quit playing Fallout New Vegas after that quest broke that I couldn't finish. Uh, and, you know, on, on, on the PC you just have, you have more options. You don't have a third party lording over you telling you what you can and can't do with your game just because they're the ones who built your computer you know the built the machine that you're playing the game on you know you don't have Dell or HP telling you what you can do with your PC games if, if you use one of their computers and so there's just a certain degree of freedom that comes with PC gaming and uh, you know that's one of the reasons that I switched and I wanted to showcase that and show you guys who are on PC how to fix this problem if you encounter it. So, uh, I'll go ahead and call this good. If y'all have any comments, questions, concerns, or suggestions, please feel free to post them in the comments section below. Uh, hope, hopefully you guys have found this video useful and informative. And as always, this is Marcus out, or Garowin in this case, since it's a gaming video. Y'all uh, take care. Have a good one.